Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're watching Bad Girls Club episode 20 of season 2. I, ooh, but you know when you're just at the tail end of something, you just like get the anxiety to finish it. I don't know, that's how I get, so I feel like this season is dragged the hell out oh my god i just want it to be over i want to finish it this one's called three's a crowd again with this three three's a crowd dumb shit i've been distancing myself from andrea since the blog but i can use this to my advantage i thought she got over it because she wasn't supposed to get mad about it i love you i love you too Despite the revealing blog, oh. Cordelia's crush on Andrea Will continued she feel to grow. Will she about what she really almost did? Yeah, how is he gonna feel about that? It's your weirdest wildest, sexual fantasy. Wildest not just No, not fantasy. just wildest, but like weirdest. Weird? You remember Captain Picard? <laughs> yeah! That's so Big Bang Theory of her. I had this fantasy where he was like captured by some like Romulans and I would rest Romulans, and, like, girl, we would you're and, like, so cute! <laughs> And we're not technically in a relationship, but we're not technically not in a relationship. Is that not the same night as she found out about the blog? Because the headbands. She's mad that um, you've never wanted me to be your girlfriend. She thinks that that's a sign that you don't really care. Oh, really? So why are you talking to me then? Because I love you. Yeah, my, my boo would tell me to tell her to shut the fuck up. <laughs> hey, I'm not being mean. I love you and I hate, I want to kill him. I know. That Josh is make her probably cheating feel. on Andrea. I absolutely know it. I know that Josh is probably cheating on. Shut the fuck up, Cordelia. You cheated on your boyfriend. So I'm afraid that when he's here, they're just gonna be rude and antagonizing him and picking on him the whole time. Probably. Probably. Most likely. Definitely. For sure. <laughs> he's here two minutes and you're already gonna go at it. Shut up. You dirty whore. No. <laughs> I'm way hotter than he is. Ugh. I'm coming to the realization that I wouldn't be cool with anybody here, <laughs> except maybe Andrea. I have a little bit of a crush on Andrea, and watching Josh touch her, and he's so disgusting, it just makes my skin crawl. Guys, what the fuck is she talking about? Watch, watch your hands there, sunshine. <laughs> hey, it's mine. Is it yours? While you're here, <laughs> I'll rent it, but that's about it. I feel like Cordelia, her roommate, is... Josh gets an interview too. <laughs> He's doing a confessional. I mean, it's cool. I mean, girl, girl, and girl actions, rad. Sorry, I'm her pimp. Let's get this straight. Oh. All right. I love how I have a say in this in my no, own life. Shut up, ho. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> that was actually funny. <laughs> love to expose him for the jerk that he is. I would like to know what the fuck you're talking about, Cordelia, to be honest. This sounds like you're just making things up. But I really feel like it's worth it. I'm just gonna work my Cordelia magic. And see, it's weird, cause like, here she's so confident about herself, and in the other episode she's like crying because she thinks she's so ugly. So if she does end up relapsing, I'm not gonna hold it against her or judge her, but I'll be there for her no matter what. Me now. <laughs> So fucking jealous. Who made you come? Who made you come? Oh my god. My bad, guys. She shouldn't have, yeah, she shouldn't have been like, come. She was begging. Andrea should have not invited Cordelia with her and Josh. Okay, I guess they did ask you to come. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was wrong. I can't refuse because I know what it feels like to be at a club when you're sober, and sometimes it's really boring. <laughs> Andrea looks so sad there. I feel bad. She's trying to be a good friend. See the colorful. Ew. I don't need to see, see this. All these colors. Can you guys imagine doing this and then the cameraman is just like. And then the boom guy's like. And then the producer's like. And then fucking Darlene's like. Absolutely not. Yo, straight out, these girls Andrea are so. Josh because fucking. they're so weird and awkward, and Andrea is so monotone. I would love to hear what it sounds like when Andrea gets down. No, you just want to hear something because you're fucking. Your shit's barking down there. Jesus. <laughs> oh, my oh my god. Are you serious? Why is he sitting like that? I'd be so embarrassed. <laughs> Uh, party's over. Darling, you're flying too much! Was it even her? Now, 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 
Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Now. Right now. Tanisha, right. you think right you now. Right now. Bell. It will turn the lights off at least. It's not Andrea's fault. I'm I'll the one who picked up the glass. I'll tell you why it's her fault. Because Andrea complains to us, complains to us behind your back all the time about you. Yikes. We saw her just once. That's nice. That's really nice. But like, what the fuck is she supposed to do? Smack that shit out of your hands? I feel like a bad friend now, okay? Because you're right. I should have done a better job. I should have made you go out with us. You don't need a, to be with me. It's fine. Like, I'm figuring this out like, on my own because I'm- Aren't you supposed to like not, I don't know, like kind of slowly get rid of the addiction and not necessarily just cut it off cold turkey because it doesn't usually work. She did have one. That was it. Also, I'm sorry. If you need help, go seek professional help. Her. After I told her that I had had so many problems with the hyenas, how dare you go and talk to them? That's you sit there and people. fucking really make me be your caretaker? No. Be a grown-up. Andrea has been going and complaining to the hyenas about me. I think she- I think she dragged that. I'm sorry. It was after the big fight. Anyone about this? She has a blog up that's talking about me. It's really nasty. Cordelia's not together. <gasps> no way. Why would he even be a friend I'll send, I'll send it to you. But again, is it like a private thing or is it- she's posting this. I'm a f up. I should put your douchebag and food tastes great. Apparently, if Andrea feels that Cordelia is so crazy and so nuts and so unstable, then instead of helping Cordelia, Andrea decides to write about her. That's not a friend. I love how she's like, oh, you went and complained about to the hyenas about like me and you know the problems I had. Yet here she is venting to Hannah, one of the hyenas. So it's like, why can you do it but she can't? Also, Hannah's so rude. Let's just say that, like, food tastes great. Okay, just call me if you need anything. Let me hug. I don't like that. I'm sorry. I'm a f Oh, up. it's about to get fucking terrible for Andrea the second she walks through that door. R.I.P. Well, shit, now I have to watch the next episode.